Handle the Enigma. Okay, there's a nice call. It's definitely slow. It's a bit risky. You don't have, like, the biggest impact on the actual lanes, but he's always off the map. So oh. you still have to play like Slardar could be there. Oh, and good play with the Savage Roar. They are still going to be able to find the first blood. And Miracle does need to be careful. Pure Fine Flames. Oh, he might turn now. And they could potentially go for this. They were able to trade the aggro, but... Yeah, GH not able to finish that one off and might actually go down to the tower. Oh, Pablo with the plays. Wasn't able to keep the aggro off of the Slardar. Wow, the rap, long rep rush. Man, he is really going for this one. Needs to be careful about the Savage Roar play. And, oh, it's still on cooldown. The glimpse back. That means Pablo actually is going to stick around here for a second. But I don't think they can find that kill. Instead, GH might be the one that ends up going down. Mind control is in the area. Stick. Black hole is available if you want to use it, but uh, not going to go for it. Might have been the play there. Needs to be in a little bit careful now. He is going to end up dropping. They find the kill on the bear with the Eidolons. Excalibur taking a good bit of damage as well. He's very low, but not dead as of it. He's going to go back in. The Eidolons might be able to kill him <laughs> off if they turn to fight, but instead... Like, I got last hits over here, guys. They're, they're busy. Take All right, I'm here. here. Eidolon's focusing others, and now Aki is going to drop. Right, Gork seems to sniff this one out as they're also diving oh. mid and no one's there. So something must be happening, right? Yeah. Radiance top. Might have to cautious about a root here, but it's almost more of a bait happening. Excalibur. Uh, they're going to Dark Rift on top of the Spirit Bear. Kind of a unique little move there. Goes for the Pit of Malice down, but... He's pretty deep into this at this point. They're going to be able to glimpse back one. Gorak going to keep oh, nice alive. Save. Man, Miracle is really low. 20 HP for him there and can still throw out the Assassin if he wants to. Mind control. Black Hole's available. Thinks about going for it. Is going to drop it now on top of each kill. And that should be more than enough to be able to find that kill. Mind control picks it up. Constant ideas of where it is that they want to go rather than... I mean, this changes it right now. If they can find kills right here and pick off Mind Control, he is going to be walking right into a black hole and throws out the Malefist to start it off. Nice purge away from it by the Oracle. He's not Fortune's End, but now TP rotation's coming in. They need to be careful. No Blink Dagger as of yet. It's on the Courier for GH. And Oracle over there to the side as well. They're starting to go onto Excalibur, taking a good bit of damage. Mind Control dropping low as well. He isn't going to be able to get off that black hole. And now Eskill also going to... Pop the Dark Rift. He actually canceled it. So they want to take this fight. Miracle has already taken down the PA. And GH does have the crush. Yeah, this is looking quite bad. Pablo also going to be in trouble. He's going to drop. So they lose the Enigma, but they take three for it. Definitely need it. I'm never going to get used to saying that. I promise. Oh, Gork. No. No. Oh, that hurts. This is a problem. No way to save this guy. Oh my god, jump forward. Oh, oh able to done, wait, but nicely done there. Stays alive with the switch, but I don't know if it's gonna last that much longer. Static Storm down, the Pit of Malice is there as well, so maybe they can find a kill onto GH, but it's not looking great right now if you're a Horde fan. Well, okay. <laughs> this is some scary stuff. Jump forward, all right, missed out a little bit. Pablo is gonna go down here, but they get the Savage Roar, keeping control of them. Kuroki is going to drop, but they threw down the Kinetic Field and the Static Storm. Ake is there. They caught the Black Hole. Oh, God. Yep, that's another kill going their way, and I don't know how you really come back from this one. Gore can try as much as he likes, but he's not even to the first Mithril Hammer of his that Deso yet. Malefice onto Ake, so he's not going to be here with them for the fight. GH. He actually... Oh, what? 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 <laughs> Oh my god, alright, that's a little bit of luck. He was going for the blink away into Crush, but then he ended up getting the Crush off as the blink was disabled. Gork somehow able to stay alive through that, but <laughs> probably is going to end up dropping nonetheless. Assassinate coming out, damage from afar is not going to be able to find the kill, but guess what? GH is there to finish him off after the fact. Caught alone, maybe not. Yeah, he does end up dropping. <laughs> that looked amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it did. Absolutely. And... I mean, the scary part is that, you know, Mind Control with that black hole up and online, Blink Dagger available. They got the Pit of Malice, a Firestorm out as well. Bagoric, Crush onto two, Static Storm onto two. Yeah, that's going to hurt a little bit, taking a lot of damage over there from Miracle. And now they've also got eyes on Ake, trying to heal up from the Shrine. Should be able to live through that one, but will he live through the Headshot Harass? No, no such luck. Double kill for Miracle. They don't even need the black hole. Mind Control GG. blinked in, he's like, oh, three-man black hole, and they were all just dead. Like, oh. All right, well, there you go, celebratory. You got to see it. It's, it's lovely to watch.
Mind Control Enigma ends up taking it down. 22 minutes, Team Liquid. Very, very strong gameplay coming out from them across the board. Pablo over on the safe lane. This guy's been playing a spectacular pudge throughout the games that we've seen. And GH maybe overstepping his bounds a little bit, able to get the no body tangos. blocks. And yeah, that's going to be first blood for Pablo. Mind Control also in trouble. Horde coming back strong in this one. And they should be able to find this kill as well. Hook back in. Ake finds the kill. And looking for the root at level five here. Telkinese is trying to help. Back in, Ake in some trouble. There's going to be the kill. Pablo's going to come in, see if he can clean up. They missed the hoof stomp a little bit. Oh, a nice little move around. And he's able to sit there and throw with the hooks. He can disrupt that entire push. He's kill. Oh, oh, living. Nice. Jukes jives through the trees. Not going to be able to get it. He didn't have level six either. And now Pablo is here as well. Miracle, he's level five. Pablo can just walk at him, I think. Right? This is the weirdest. Yeah, well, he has to pick the right direction. Yeah. Uh, Out of there. They have the rot. Slow down. He doesn't have a spin. No, 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 Pablo. Oh, Pablo. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, this might be the kill. They are going to be able to find it. Matumbo Man drops the healing ward as well. Excuse me, Miracle drops the healing ward. Sharing their responsibilities. Oh, my God. Miracle onto Pablo. He uses the hoof stomp to take him down, and Pablo is just going to end up going down here. Goes for the runaway, and Miracle slowed down. Omnislash is there, but they're going to be able to find the kill. Nicely played. They needed that one desperately. Might be able to find more. Matumba Man is there as well as Ake going to get ran down, eaten up by the bear. <laughs> Miracle takes the kill. Oh, my goodness. What? <laughs> oh, yeah, with the centaur. Oh, this might be enough. He should realize that this is happening, though, and Matumbo Man in some trouble, able to find him. A lot of damage being dealt out. They are going to be able to get the Savage Roar off, but Matumbo Man is all alone, and I don't... Well, actually, Miracle is there. They are going to be able to walk away. No, Matumbo Man's going to drop. They take down E-Skill right before his Blink Dagger got purchased, and is he really going to juke him out like that? Hiding behind the trees. He is going to get caught out finally, but the lift, the Fistic Flare comes out. It's oh, not go. enough. They kill off the Juggernaut. Nice hook catching him there, but this should end up being Excalibur's demise. They have the damage pushback as well. Blinding Light. The Requiem of Souls comes out. Doing a good bit of damage. Might be able to bring back Kuroki. They are going to be able to find that kill. Excalibur still alive somehow. Mind Control trying to get it. Wasn't able to get the clap off, but this should still be a death of him. It is going to cost him his life, though. Eskill is back up and online, and this might be enough to get him it now, but Pablo stakes the kill away. Oh, pings? I already he spots him. Tank. Oh, he's going to get stunned. Oh, no. Oh, the centaur. Okay, run. This, uh, that's not going to work. He's... Well, stop. Oh, Pull back in. Nice. Uh, I think that that might have been a little bit incidental, but nonetheless, it is going to end up possibly working out in their favor. He gets the long-range dismember. Aether Lens, please. And that is going to be enough. Hook back in. Oh, Pablo making the plays. That's what they needed. Eskill picks it up as well. They had that gank top lane. Oh, geez, Miracle. All right, I take back. So oh. I read of what they're up to. Nice. They got the Dismember. They got the Mystic Flare. Miracle goes down yet again. And Kuro is going to try and run into this right now. Pablo is just going to immediately go for the TP out, rotting for good measure. They are going to move in again Dude. towards Miracle. In trouble, caught out, and going to be killed off. And guess what? Pablo still has hooked Dismember. Oh, a little bit off the mark right there. Not able to find it. No Blink Dagger as of yet. Have to see if Pablo can play, uh, play into that in these engagements. This looks like a pretty good moment right now. Gork again going to be caught out, and that should be the death of him. Yeah, they find that kill. Nicely played. I, I think that this is probably the better option for them, because Liquid have been getting continuously picked off, but now the pressure is going to come onto the towers, and they need some way to deal with it. Oh, really good hook around the bear. They pull him back in and take down Miracle. Yo, Pablo! This is, yeah, this is some this good guy. stuff. All right, the Savage Roar going to keep him back for the moment. They managed to find the root as well as onto E-Skill. The nice stun from the lift off of Kuroki. They are going to kill off that Centaur. And Excalibur pops the Manta style, trying to run away. They're going to try and get out of here. They stole Stampede, though. Hooking back out his ally, but it doesn't matter. Matumba Man on a killing spree. The Brulings are chasing as well. They were able to find the kill onto Ake also. So everybody down right now for a horde, and this is the problem. Too much damage too quickly. Three buybacks across the board. They hook back in the bear. A little bit unfortunate on that one. There's three or four people ganking him. Doesn't even have a board. Top lane. They found him again. Miracle. 
in some trouble. Pulled back in. Omni Slash onto everybody. I don't know if it's going to be enough to find a kill. Nice timing on that stun and end up being able to take down that Juggernaut. He's creating a lot of space. Oh, nice blink away as well by Pudge. Kuro's looking for it. Looking for the lift and the pullback. They do have the initiation. Pulling him back in. Ake is there. They're able to hook. No, they ended up missing it. They weren't able to break the split and it goes through the Brulings. Wasn't able to save the Shadow Fiend. No buyback. 80 seconds. This could be a disaster right now. Ake not going to be able to stay alive either. Oh, did he rot? He didn't rot. Curl has hook. Ooh, wow. That, a, a rare mistake. Oh, he pulls it back in. Nice stomp to break that up. They're going to be able to lift away from that Mystic Flare that comes out. Slow down for the moment. That is going to be another dead. Pablo buys back into the game, battling outside of the base. This isn't going to end well. I do not believe Excalibur looking for a big fight here. And Omni Slash almost able to take down that Weaver. Not quite in time. They do kill off the Juggernaut finally, but they're also going to end up losing the Shadow Fiend. Just too much damage being dealt out. Pablo used the hook, brought in Kuroki, but not going to be enough. There's all your mana gone. GG ends up getting called as Liquid take it 2-0 over Horde. It was an interesting game. It was a good example of just like so much focus on Miracle, but the overall resources just always flowing.